What's up guys? Oh, <coughs> what's up guys? So I'm back with another vlog. Um, I took a few days off. I've been really just tired again and getting school done and <clears throat> other stuff. Ugh. What is up with my throat? Other stuff done. But um, I'm back. It's Tuesday right now. We're headed to um, down the street to an embroidery company to maybe have some sweatshirts embroidered or some hats or some just stuff. We're going to go look at stuff that we can have embroidered. And she's right down the street, which is cool. So she may be able to do my hats or my sweatshirts or whatever or if I get bigger orders. But um, the reason why I'm spinning so much is because I'm on my hoverboard. Remember when these things were popular, like, everybody had to go out and buy them, and then, like, they started blowing up and stuff, and I didn't get the kind that blows up. I got the good one with, like, the Samsung battery or whatever. But, um, let's get today's vlog started. Hope you're having a great day. Let's make today positive, and let's just have a good day. So, guys, we're back from my meeting. Um, went pretty well. Um, she's gonna get some, or we're gonna get some designs together. And do some hats and some t-shirts. And the reason why I'm squinting is because I'm in front of the window and it's really sunny. But um, we're going to go from there. And my dad found a bottling place that does New Hampshire made soda. Um, so we're going to go ahead there. I think it's near Hampton Beach. So it's about an hour drive from here. Not too bad. And we're going to go check that out. And maybe I can film the bottling thing, which would be really cool. But uh, right now we're just waiting and then we're going to head out. Go get it. Come on, Harry. Get it. Get your ball. Come on. Come on. Come on. What are you doing? What are you doing? We're on the road headed to near that soda place. Um, um we're gonna go there and it's near kinda near Hampton Beach and there's a lot of stuff to do there even though it's winter time and a lot of stuff is closed. But there's a lot of shops we can go to and different things like that. So um, we got about an hour drive and we'll see when we get there. So we're still around town, we're in Laconia right now. We stopped at a uh, store called Sunflower and it's like a health food store. And I got a protein shake. And then I also got a coffee bar, which sounded pretty interesting. It's a mocha coffee bar. So I'm gonna try that. Um, we're headed that way. We're kinda looking at the stores around here the healthier stores and then we found the soda that we were looking for. So guys, we just got out of a crepe place and it was like this little, kind of like a mom and pop store and it was, um, they had crepes of like a dinner crepe, a dessert crepe, and I got, ended up getting a Nutella banana and brown sugar crepe, which was so good. And my dad got a turkey dinner one that had like turkey stuffing, gravy, stuff like that, which was really good. And um, now we're headed to that soda place and it's called Squam Scott. I ended up having it before, but not knowing it. So we're headed there right now and I hope I can videotape to show you guys like the whole thing, how they do the bottling and stuff. And the guy said that he's gonna give us some free stuff to take home and try. But uh, we're headed there right now. We should be there in about five, ten minutes.
so we just got out. That was absolutely cool, and I'm probably gonna have to put music over it because it's total, like, it's loud. The glass is going together, and the, the water, and the soda, and everything, but we got a bunch of different flavors to try out, um, and my dad has another case back there, but I would love, and my dad wants to, we want to carry their stuff in our store, and it's a really cool soda, like, it's, it's owned, yeah, it's tasty. It's been family owned for 154 years, and they have a machine from 1932. That that was the machine you get just saw, um, which is really cool. And we got a bunch of different flavors. They have 24 different flavors, so we got say, we got 12 to try out, and um, we'll go from there. But we had like a three-hour drive down here, so we're gonna drive back home. It's probably like a hour and a half two hours because we took the long way but um that was our adventure for today hope you guys like it and i will see you when we find something interesting so guys we just made it to hampton beach uh we weren't planning on coming to the beach but we were already basically here so um it's dead here and it's winter time so obviously there's not going to be anybody swimming or anything but um there's no snow here does it it snows here right yep. yeah so there's there's absolutely no snow here like, there's nothing. But, uh, I think if the beach is not closed off, we're gonna head on to the beach. And I told my dad if I brought my wetsuit and my skimboard, I would've went skimboarding. Even though it's probably, like, negative five degrees. But, um, it would've been kinda cool. But we're gonna go check out the beach now, and, uh, we'll see you when we get that. Like, bleh. We'll see you when we get out there. I'm standing this way, so there's not as much wind noise, but here at the beach. And it's empty and freezing cold, but I'm gonna go feel the water and see how it is. The water is absolutely freezing. I would not even go in there. I said I would with my wetsuit, there's no way. I would literally like stop breathing and just freeze an ice cube. It, it was, it's so cold. I don't even get how the seagulls are standing in it. Like it's freezing. Hey guys, we're checking out Mr. Crab's house. Uh, he's got two floors, lower level, upper level. Um, Here's his roof over here. It's a little broken. Um, and everything's a little rusty and kind of filled with barnacles. But uh, other than that, he's got a nice house. So that was our time at Hampton Beach. I've had enough of the beach for about a year till summertime comes. Um, it's really cold. I have two sweatshirts on and I'm freezing, but uh, the view is really nice. I like where it turns yellow, like right there, and then right there. It looks really cool, but uh, we're heading home and uh, see if we find any new adventures on the way home. bit of an update we're at Bass Pro Shop right now um, I got some stuff from my bug out bag so as you guys can see um, well you can't see but it's the next day uh, we made it home um, I kind of just worked on school and passed out and just was really tired the car rides make me very tired but what do you want what He's like sniffing me for some reason. But um, I think I'm going to end today's vlog here. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time.